Good afternoon, and welcome to another edition of the Roberts Recap. As a reminder, this is where we bring you three of the most salient agenda items from our most recent board meeting, and the team and I attempt to do so in three minutes or less. The first item that we want to bring to you this evening comes from a student celebration. At last night's board meeting, we had student Air Force GROTC Commander and Assistant Commander Emily Sennett and Benjamin Neubauer present to us a high level overview of all of the outstanding things that are happening with our Air Force GROTC program. The program under the watchful eyes of Chief Holmes and retired Major Nygaard is nationally ranked. As a matter of fact, what was shared with us is this program is ranked within the top 5% of programs in the entire country. We are grateful for the presentation by those two cadets last night. The second student presentation, one that we've brought to you before, is Christopher Zhao. Christopher is one of our outstanding AP performance students. Remember, our advanced placement program and our scores have continued to rise and is ranked nationally. But Christopher has taken it to the next level. He scored perfectly on his AP research exam, and he is one of only 311 students in the entire world, which is just over 1% of students who take the AP assessments to score perfectly. We are proud of these three students and all of the other students who knock on our doors each and every day. Next agenda item that we discussed last night that is of utmost importance comes first with tremendous gratitude to the board for a unanimous approval of a proposal that I brought to them on behalf of the core team. Last night's proposal, which was approved, is with regards to salaries and compensation for three groups of individuals, our secretaries, our education assistants, and our information technology and maintenance staff. We recognize that while each of the 800 plus adults, teachers, leaders, and staff who work in our buildings are valued, and we wanna make sure that we're consistently focusing on equitable distributions of salaries, compensations, and resources, these three groups have been in ongoing conversations with yours truly and members of the core team. And we want them to know that we truly value the work that they do. While last night's approval came at a cost of about $391,000 to the board, both the board and the district's leadership want to make sure that it is very, very clear that we truly value the work that each of these members of the foregoing groups have done and continue to do. We are proud of the work that they're doing and we want to say thank you. Remember, the Roberts recap, three salient items, three minutes or less. We look forward to seeing you again soon.